Well, good morning from Nazawa Onsen. We have arrived in the ski resort and it's fair to say there's quite a bit of snow. So this is what we're dealing with. <laughs> yeah, that is the downstairs of the building. You basically can't see out of it. There is so much powder. So we're heading up the mountain today and gonna do some skiing. I'm so excited to get up there, but I think the visibility is gonna be quite poor and the wind seems to be picking up a bit. It is still snowing, so it might be a bit of a whiteout, but we're really excited because we've heard that Japan has some of the best snow in the world and it's absolutely amazing powder snow. And to be honest, from what I can see from down here, I think that that might actually be correct. Um, but while we're still warm and cozy, I think I'll give you guys a little bit of a room tour. So we're staying in a Ryokan, which is a traditional Japanese inn. And in a Ryokan, you don't actually have proper beds. So I'll show you what I mean. So yeah, so basically what happens is they have these little futons that they roll out and you sleep on futons. And do you know what? They're a little bit weird to get used to because when you're used to a western style mattress and having a bed that completely supports you, like no matter what position you lay in, to sleep on these can feel a bit weird. So the first night I woke up had a little bit of a bad back, but now I feel amazing and I've just it's just completely sorted out my sleeping alignment. So I read a load of articles that said that the futons are actually the best way to sleep because it makes you have to sleep in a, with good posture otherwise you get a bad back basically. <laughs> so for me now I guess it's getting up the mountain and let's ski. <laughs> this really long woodland track and we're on our way to see the snow monkeys which live here in a sort of like snow monkey national park that was started quite recently by a guy who discovered them while he was out hiking and we're really excited to see them they look super fluffy and cute but we're literally on the slippiest track of life to get there because there's so much ice everywhere it's so cold
dinner. Um, we've had a really long day and just really excited for some food. And tonight I'm extra excited because we're actually eating in a real traditional Japanese restaurant with a completely traditional Japanese meal to the point where there's not even chairs. You sit on these like cushions with a seated back on the floor and it just looks so cool, completely different to anything we've done before and yet while we've been in Japan, so really excited to try Japanese dining and see what's on offer. So there's sashimi, pork katsu, mystery balls. I think this is sake. Yes, amazing. Mm, and then we've crazy. got rice in there. And then what's this? Like meat and is this like a stew or something? Like a ramen. It's really tasty. And some sake now. 